Greetings and salutations YouTube, it's Adrian here. Welcome to another episode of Goodwill Hunting, where we go to various Goodwills and see what treasures we can find. Today we are in the lovely town of Costa Mesa, California, and I'm super excited to take you guys into this Goodwill. It's small, but it packs a big punch because this one is like a really nice store. Like they have a lot of stuff, and it's like always filled to the brim with like exciting items that I can't wait to look through. So if you guys love thrifting, you love vlogs, and all that fun stuff, don't forget to subscribe hit the little bell button for notifications add me on Instagram it's Hadrian and just like it's spelled here for behind the scenes thrifting fun home decor and all that fun stuff food and cute dogs and yeah so much fun stuff so don't forget to add me on there and check out my shop it's Hadrian.com to see what I have for sale for all my thrifting adventures but without further ado let's head to that store right now and check out what they have all right you guys we are looking through the handbags the Dina and Ozzy. Oh, look how cute this is. Betsy Johnson. Oh, those straps though are like. Ugh. Oh, for some reason, like the. Um, I love the vintage Betsy Johnson stuff that's made of like authentic leather. The new stuff, I feel like, leaves a little something to be desired. What is this? Charles and Keith. Their stuff is leather too though, huh? I kind of like that design though, it's kind of cool. The sack. This is like that um, schnabry issue looking bag. Look at that hardware, it looks like... Just like it. <laughs> oh, what is this? Forever 21. Here's another fake reissue bag. This halogen bag is actually super cute. It's leather. Missing the crossbody strap. This one's $12.99. Halogen is um, one of the Nordstrom house brands. It's kind of cute. I almost thought it was a Marc Jacobs at first when I saw it. But uh, I wish I had the crossbody strap. Nah, I don't think the resale for these is like too strong anyway. Okay, we're just looking through the rest of the bags. What is? This is a Betsy Johnson. I cannot tell if this is leather or not. Let's check it out. Genuine leather. It has like candy or something. This is an interesting looking bag. I'm gonna hold on to that. Like that looks kind of cool. Let's see what other goodies we can come up with right here. Come upon and see. I want to look through the shoes really quick and see if there's anything that catches my eye. There's so many shoes I don't know what to look at. Report. Dollhouse. I found some really nice shoes here before so can always happen again. Oh these are Jack or Jack Purcell Converse. You just need a good wash and they'll be good to go again. Franco Sardo. You always have a bunch of Nikes. These are actually kind of cool. I like these. They're kind of cute. I wonder if they'll fit anyone I know. Uh, size 7. No, too big. Uh, these, please tell me these are Stella McCartney for Adidas shoes. <laughs> no way. Check that out. Stella McCartney for Adidas. Size. This is perfect. Alright, let's see what else we can find. I was really excited for this Stella McCartney's. 
I just posted them on my Instagram, so if you guys don't follow me on there, you have to. You get like some up-to-date goodies that I find on there. Um, oh, do you see these? These are poor la victoire shoes. These are like really fancy and expensive. They're a size and Look at that heel. They're actually in really good shape. I don't know, should I get them? $9.99. A bunch of Nikes. Look at this. More Nikes. We got some Michael Kors right here. These are 25 bucks. Yikes. Pricey. These are, I don't even know what this brand is. Oh, look at these little kid Nikes. These are actually not bad. Ooh, I just found some Cole Huns. I, I, I don't know why I like these shoes. Like, I like, like shoes that look like old man shoes. Like, that's, that's me. <laughs> it's like my aesthetic old man shoes. But they kind of look uh, a little Gucci-ish. Like, do I look like an old man? Like, don't mind my horrible tan popping out right there. Like, look at that. These are actually pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie, made in India. They're a ten and a half. Uh, I know I should have some socks, but I don't have any with me. <laughs> I don't know. Are these more cold hands? I can't tell. Found these champion sliders. I think I'm gonna get them. <laughs> I have the other one right here. Like it's a little bit of cracking, but like whatever. I'm just gonna like literally wear them around the house. They're just really comfy, so I'm gonna grab these. You guys, check it out. Some Sperry's that look almost exactly the same to what I'm already currently wearing. Just a little bit lighter. Oh, but these are size 11. Crazy. These are like way too big. Okay, we're not gonna get these, but it's okay because pretty much wearing the same shoes already at the moment anyway. So many Nikes, 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 Nikes on Nikes. Look at these plastic Michael Kors shoes. These are cute, what size are they? Just found some more Michael Kors, these are like booties. These are kinda cute. Okay, these would've been super cute for Kate, except like the fronts are like a hot mess on there. But... I'm looking at the shoes that they have here. Oh my god, look at those cute little kid shoes. There's some Asics. Oh, I'm dead! They're sinking cute. Oh, look at these. These are kind of cool. They're a size 2-3. Oh, look at the front though. Like that's just like lifting right off. Those are cool though. I feel like the kids would like those, but they're already like falling apart. My kids are tough on shoes, so. We have some Viva Lamb shoes. They're kinda $10. They're kinda cool, but eh. All these seven for all mankind jeans. $9.99. Are these pieces of lettuce? <laughs> they kind of look like lily pads, but they're kind of cool. Two ninety nine each. I'm trying to like check out all this stuff. Bath and Body Works. They have the Starbucks Christmas mug. Two ninety nine. Green tag or sticker, 50% off. Thresholds. This little person's face. They have this the wallpaper. It's so fabulous. Opal house. This one is a really pretty. 
$4.99. I think they just made these like super cheap because I don't remember them being $4.99. Should I get one for the kids? Oh my gosh, it's a strawberry. Stop. Check it out you guys, I found this fairy tale mold. This is William Sonoma. It's $4.99. It has a unicorn, which is like the primary reason why I'm obsessed. So like I definitely need it, right? Unicorns. And then also this is John's all-time favorite anime. And guess he found Mug. He's gonna be so excited. Okay, now I'm looking at the vases. This is a Vera Wang vase. I was like, this color is so pretty, and it turns out to be Vera Wang. And $3.99. Hot dog. Why is this thing so crystally? Oh, it's lead crystal. Made in USA. Fancy. $12.99. What? This thing swans all over it. That's fun. <gasps> stop. Is this an elephant? And stop. Is it a planter? And stop it. It's so cute. You know, Hadrian loves these things. Love it so much. I'm talking about myself in the third person. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Okay, on to more American Atelier. Oh, they have a white one of these things. I love these things. I feel like we have so many. Ooh, this one's a pure one, $7. I also really like this basket. I think I saw it last time. But it has like a thing right there, so. Oh, and they still have this little Chinese takeout box, which I think is, which I think is so cute. I'm guest obsessed. They have one of these um, feed canisters. They had these at Target. I remember this was for charity because a lot of a lot of companies did this, and this one's the Target. It's cute, $4.99. You guys, look how pretty this is. It's like a neon lemon yellow. Almost. I'm trying to see if this is like a Pampered Chef thing, but I don't think it is. But I still want to see what it is anyway. So, try to take everything off of it. Oh, stop. Is this like inlaid? Oh, I love anything with inlay. So pretty. We have some cool carpets. I like this print. They like book prints. Oh gosh, this thing is still so expensive, but it's so cool. I really like this table, it's 20 bucks. Alright you guys, I just got everything inside the car. So don't forget to subscribe, hit the little bell button for notifications. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow for the haul video because I got some amazing items that I can't wait to share with you guys. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know down in the comments below what your favorite item was that we found. Let me know if you guys have found anything really cool recently as well because I love hearing about your finds as well. And don't forget to check out today's vlog. It goes up at 2 p.m. Pacific Center Time. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys then. Bye.